That's right, it'll haunt them for sure. Not only was this the second rivalry game that the Tar Heels have lost this season, but it was the second one that they had a chance to win late in the fourth quarter. But guys, we're not going to start with the fourth quarter. Instead, we're starting with the first half, and we're starting with a fight. Check this out. In the first half of today's game, the Wolfpack and Tar Heels tried to burn off some of those Thanksgiving calories. I guess they heard boxing is pretty good cardio. When these guys weren't literally fighting on the field, they were fighting for yards, and that's a battle that State won early on. The half that pass from Jalen Samuels to Stephen Lewis worked to perfection. And that is not where the big plays ended for the pack. Matt Days runs over and runs through the entire Tar Heels defense. NC State was up by 14 at the half. But in the fourth quarter, the Tar Heels made a game of it. Mitch Trubisky tosses the moon ball up high. He gave Buck Howard time to run under it and then run into the end zone. Then on fourth down with the game in the balance, Trubisky goes back to Howard. Oh, my goodness. Buck dropped the ball. It bounced off his fingertips. The ref called it incomplete because it was incomplete. That would be the last chance UNC had. State beats their rivals from Chapel Hill 28 to 21. The most frustrating thing is just that we lost the state. I mean, I don't, I hate the state, so uh, that's the first and foremost thing. If we had won, it'd be a totally different atmosphere in here. I told them last week after the game that we were going to win this game. I guarantee the win. And uh, it's because I believe in my brothers, I believe in my coaching staff, and that's what happened. Well, this win means the Wolfpack are now bowl eligible, so their senior players get to suit up for one more time in their college careers.